Hey bullies, it's your girl Boulevard Fox and today I am doing my wash day routine with you guys using one of my favorite brands right now, TGIN. Thank God it's natural and let's get into this video. It has been about a week and a half since I've done my hair. It's so matted and frizzy. I'm so excited for wash day. I don't think many people say that, but I'm so excited for this wash day. So I'm going to start by getting my hair nice and drenched with some cool water and then separate my hair into two big sections to get ready for shampoo. So don't hate me guys, but I did not use a pre-poo today. I was just being kind of lazy. All my aloe gel was used up last week and I did not feel like making some more today. So I jumped straight in with the shampoo. I prefer to use this rake-like method to help distribute the shampoo through my hair. It helps make sure I get the scalp nice and cleansed as well as my ends. After distributing shampoo to both halves of my hair, I like to go in and give myself a nice scalp massage, then rinse half of my hair and get ready for a conditioner. I apply my conditioner from root to tip using this raking method again. Once I feel like my hair has a nice amount of slip in it, I can start detangling. I start with finger detangling and then I go in with my tools to detangle even further. Don't be scared to pile on that conditioner. It's so great for your hair and is definitely a must when detangling. So keep pumping. You'll see, I probably pumped 50 times. <laughs> Finger detangling is always a must for me. It just helps reduce a lot of shedding. I can feel exactly where my knots are and I can help guide them and separate them so much easier than using a brush. Do you guys finger detangle first or go straight in with your tools? I figured I'd give you guys a little close-up action. When you're applying your deep conditioner, make sure you get into the insides of your hairs. 
It's so easy for those pieces to get missed, especially when you're working in big sections. Obviously, this video is sped up, but please take your time detangling your hair and applying your deep conditioner. This is one of the most important parts of your wash day. After detangling and applying conditioner to my entire head, I go through with my tools again and make sure every strand is saturated. Then I apply a disposable shower cap to lock in the moisture and start the deep conditioning process. Once the deep conditioning process is complete, I rinse my hair in cold water, then tie my hair in a t-shirt to dry. But wait, let me give y'all the slow-mo real quick because who is she? I can't even believe that's my hair. I've come a long way. Now that my hair has been washed and deep conditioned, I let it dry. 
for about 10, 15 minutes in that old t-shirt. And my hair is currently damp, no products. So this is it, damp, no products. Look, my curls are still learning how to behave. 